Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration reading for the Gemini Sun, Moon and Rising for the third week of August 2017. This week begins from the 14th until the 20th. This is going to be the third week, so please remember to listen to your Sun, Moon and Rising and also go back and listen to the month of August reading because there will be more information for you for the second week, the two last weeks of August because you're now in the third week. This is going to be a week of the energy vibration of the tower. It's going to be the zodiac energy of fire. And it's a week where a lot of transformation is going to happen because whenever the week of the tower comes up, that means we're releasing things that no longer serve us. The eclipse has just passed. So we're releasing things that no longer serve us. And we are coming up with good things because you have the energy vibration of the wheel of fortune. So for you, Geminis, whatever is happening in this week, money is not going to be a problem at all okay money is not going to be a problem at all the wheel of fortune is bringing you a lot of materialistic success i'm seeing here um the energy vibration of the um the earth energy you have the ace of pentacles you have the five of pentacles in reverse and you have the four of of coins this carry the energy vibration of coins for the pentacles so the wheel of fortune is going to bring you a lot of money whatever the money uh, whatever it's going to bring you um, it's going to be good okay because um, you're going to realize that you are going to be um, starting something new in life so the wheel of fortune is very is, is a very positive cards so whatever you're doing in this week it's a yes week whatever you're doing and whatever you are about to do it's a yes week for you um, for you um, Gemini's it's going to be a yes week remember to listen to your Sun Moon and rising sign okay we're moving forward and we're going to look at the energy vibration of your week we begin the week with the heart energy and then we end the week the working week we end the working week with the ace of one so new you you begin the week with the ace of pentic the ace of coins yes and you're going to end the week with the ace of wands so whatever is happening here whatever the situation is whatever is happening for you in this week it's going to bring you a lot of success it's going to bring you a lot of success so this is going to be very good this is going to be a very very exciting very good so um you are also here in your, in the week so on tuesday tuesday is going to be your best best tuesday um, Monday Tuesday um, Friday and um, Saturday is going to be your best best day okay so let's see what is going on for you guys Wow let's see what is going on for you guys let's see what is going on for you guys Wow okay 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 let's see what is going on for you guys okay as we start the week for, for you um for you um gemini's you start the week with an energy vibration of the um the ace of coins you start the week with the energy vibration of the ace of coins and this is going to be positive whatever the situation is this is the earth energy vibration so your financial security is going to be you're going to get a message about your financial security this is going to be extremely good so whatever your financial situation was you're going to get the message that it's going to be very very good whatever situation that is happening you are working with the energy vibration of uh, the ten of swords and as we turn her up this energy vibration of the ten of swords that is happening is for you women so whoever you women are whatever the, the situation is if it's study financiering um, study financiering um, you're asking for money for help whatever it is you raise a pay um, you're getting help to pay off your student loan whatever the situation is this ace of Pentacles for you women are going to come in whatever money 
um because this is you are and you carry the energy vibration of uh, the sword energy so for you women whatever is happening you are about to receive a lot of money so you gemini women on monday you're going to realize that you're about to receive so it could be the lottery winning and that sort of a thing so um you're going to realize that you're going to be having a lot of money on tuesday for the men it's your own energy vibration for Tuesday for the men there is a lot of clarity coming in for you on Tuesday so for you Gemini men and it doesn't really matter what age you are there's a lot of clarity whatever the situation is that whatever that was happening there is a whole lot of clarity coming to you coming into you on Tuesday because you're going to see things you're going to see things clearly Whatever the situation is, you're going to see things really clearly now. And whatever the situation was and is about to happen for you is that you're going to see things very clearly. So you need to understand where you are for you men on, on Tuesday because um, information, things are going to be extremely clear. You're going to understand what has been happening. In the middle of the week and crowned in your week, you have the energy vibration of the five of pentacles in reverse. Whatever the situation is, you have the energy of the five of pentacles in reverse. You have two reverse card in this week. Okay, so whatever that has been happening, you're going to realize that your financial situation, whatever hardship you were going through, you're going to see clarity about this and why this was happening. So whatever the clarity that is going to come in, you're going to see a clarity of whatever has been happening and see seeing that certain aspect and seeing because you have the two of swords and you are working with your energy vibration and this is good for you Gemini's in this week because whatever there's a so much swords energy going on and this is going to be extremely good so whatever hardship you have with your financial life and your financial materialistic this is going to be um, you're going to see in a clarity a way out of it because a Monday for the ladies uh, the ace of Pentacles a lot of money will be coming in to you you're going to hear about um, your financial situation it's going to be much better as we look forward and we are looking at the energy vibration for um, the four of coins uh, and the energy vibration of the four of coins on Thursday is that you're holding on to your materialistic gains whatever is happening you are holding on very tight to your materialistic gains and you're not about to give it away so whatever is happening for you Gemini's in this week you're at an end of a situation where whatever your materialistic gains of loss was you are at that end of the situation and you're open for balance to come in your life and you have the energy vibration of the wheel of fortune so this is why a lot of people is going to hold on on their financial situation whatever is happening in this week you Gemini's are not going to give a penny away the wheel of fortune is going to bring you a lot of um, money but yet still a lot of materialistic wealth and you're going to hold on fast to them whatever the situation is you're going to hold on very very fast to them so you know seeing and being and knowing what is happening around you you're going to understand how positive this is as we go forward we have the energy of the ace of wands the energy of the ace of wands is a very positive energy because what is happening is that there is going to be a new beginning coming in this new beginning whatever it is and whatever aspect and however it's going to um affect you as a person who is watching this because there's thousands of you out there that is watching it well how whatever this energy vibration of this new beginning it can be for work it can be for a career it can be for school it can be for a new study it can be for um, you're moving from one work to another so it can be new beginnings of you finding out who you are you seeing yourself in a true positive light that sort of a thing you're going to be successful with this so whatever the new beginning that is coming in for you you're going to be extremely successful because this is as if the universe have guide you to where you need to be and this is going to bring in new positive energies into your life and this is going to make you even see how wonderful certain aspects and certain situations are going to be happening in your life so this is going to be good whatever the situation is you're going to understand that these new beginnings you are going to be 
very very successful with these new beginning you're going to be victorious in whatever new endeavor that you are about to start as we go forward we have the energy of the Sun on Saturdays congratulations you guys are the first um, people to get the energy of the Sun in this card deck because I'm using a new card deck this is the back of it I'm using the orbs it's the orbs and you have the energy of the Sun and the eight of cups so the energy of the Sun is that whatever is as you know been happening in your life there is a new um, endeavor new success new things are about to enter your life and with that you are walking away from the old and looking for something new okay you're walking away from the old and looking for something new this is the new card deck that I'm using I find it to be a wonderful deck so um, if you'd like to you know radiate with it it's uh, the um, the orbs Torak and I love it I so really love it I like the green I like so whatever is happening on Saturday you're walking away from it and the energy of the Sun is coming in to bring you positivity positive energy successful endeavors and that sort of a thing as we move forward we have the energy vibration of the moon so what is happening here the energy vibration of the moon we have the sense of the as um, 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 your people having um, conflicts okay so as we look at the situation the energy of the moon is that this moon is shining down and is showing you because you're thinking this moon is an intuition moon this is not a moon of this moon is awakening your intuition because the eclipse is just left so this moon is coming down and 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 showing you clarity and and communicating with you and awakening your telepathic but awakening your inner wisdom and your feminine wisdom so this is a positive moon because this is a moon of your intuition whatever is happening you're seeing the conflicts that is going on around you you're seeing the conflicts it's as if your your angels and guides are opening up and showing you the conflicts of situation that has been going on around you so whatever the situation was and whatever the conflicts um, this is a positive one because people are fighting for something and they're fighting for something because there you are you saw that this was a wedding and people of all different races are there and they're trying to catch this bouquet they're trying to catch this bucket that's why I don't see the five of one cards to be such a conflict it's a, it's a good conflict it's a conflict that is not serious the five of swords conflicts is now you know you're gonna get a beaten or I'm gonna get a beat you know but this one is a, an, a friendly fight a friendly fight with the five of swords is a friendly fight because they're pushing and gathering up together because they want to catch this bucket this 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 bucket of flowers so you know is um, is a positive um, one that is going on here my guides have been uh, guide me to let you know which um, Tara, the little small cards. This is from Vanessa Tara. Vanessa Tara. Okay. I have been, you know, using and testing out new, um, um, new Tara decks. Okay. So, as we look at um, your the, the, your week is going to be positive because you yourself are in your in, in the week. Okay. So whether you're a man or a woman, your energy vibration is in this week, and a whole lot of swords energies are here protecting you on Monday. It's protecting your financial situation on Monday. Whoever you female women are about, um, some of you who are connected with the King of Swords, who is the energy vibration from a, a Libra or a um, another Gemini or a Aquarius, you're finally seeing a situation, or they are finally seeing a situation. They're divorcing you, and you are ending up with a lot of money. Whatever it is, it's as if you know this. It's as if you have a partner that is um, a Gemini, a, a, um, a Gemini, a Libra, or a Aquarius, and they're divorcing you and you're going to end up with a lot of money but they're seeing clarity about something about you so you might be thinking okay you know thank you but 
the intuition, the energy of the moon is that you're taking this money and you're walking away from this person. Whoever it is for the women, you're taking the money and you're walking away from the person. This is in the first part of the week. So this is saying that a lot of people who are going to divorce, your divorce is going to be final and you are going to receive that money. So what is whatsoever is happening? I mean, your partner see you as a money grabber though. You know, don't 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 forget that it's here. Your partner sees you as a money grabber. So whatsoever is happening, whatever situation that is taking place, your partner is going to see you as a money grabber. But anyway, take the money or whoever this person is. They have to pay you money. Take the money and walk away. Do not look back at them. Okay. The energy vibration of this week is going to be the energy of your money. Um, it's a week of uh, um, your materialistic needs. You're trying to protect your materialistic needs. So that is going to be the energy vibration. You're seeing clarity how you should protect your materialistic needs. And this is um, positive. As we look at the second half of the week, you have the four of pentacles. You have the energy of the moon, your intuition, your, your receiving message. So it's all about the money in this week and it's all about new beginning it's 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 all about the money and new beginnings and what is happening is that you have the ace of one and the ace of sword on Friday and this is this is very positive the ace of ones is um, the, the energy of new beginnings and you have a victorious outcome so whatsoever that was happening you have been protecting your materialistic possession in so many ways and on Fridays you have a new beginning and a successful outcomes to whatever the situation was so this is extremely positive this is really um, um, seriously positive your intuition is awakening up your intuition but yes you your feminine aspect of who you are and your feminine aspect of yourself there is going to be a friendly competition on on Sunday, but it's okay. A friendly competition is as if people are trying to, you know, the do outdo you in a situation, that sort of a thing. You know, people who do friendly competition is that your ego is so high that you think you're so good and you're so better than some some other people. And I've seen this um, often. I've seen that people will look at. Uh, um, something what I've done and they're trying to do something else but yeah it's not in your energy vibration so you will want to do a friendly kind of competition but I'm not in competition with anyone because I know who I am whenever you are not in in competition with other people you are you are knowing who you are you have your own energy vibration so you don't have to be in competition once you're going to be in competition with people is that you don't know who you are and your ego is so boosted in and as if I can do it better than her or I can do this so that is your ego but how long can you do it can you and uh, go to the sense of the outrunning of whatsoever is happening so this is another thing for us all to understand what is happening to us and whatever the friendly competition is uh, realize that you know let that person go just let them because they're gonna fall on their faces so whatever it happened because whenever you you are going to start something and have this competition against someone you're going to see how these things are going to fall fall out uh, um, in this sort of an endeavor so be aware of this so this is going to be a wonderful week the energy of love um, the energy of love is going to be on Saturday whatever is happening with the energy of love it's going to be on Saturday some people will be walking away because some people are divorcing and finally their divorces are over and they'll be walking away the energy of love is going to be in a positive way but it's going to be um, in the sense that friendly competition with some people but in the other sense is that you're walking away from something that you don't want anymore you know and then you are going to find someone much better and a situation that is going to um, be positive more positive for you in your life so this is going to be good I'm working with because my guides and angels wants me to work with the chakras and let's see what chakras you have the energy of the base chakra and I can understand why um, the energy of the base chakra comes up is because you weren't 
vibrating with healing your base chakra and that's why the wheel of fortune is bringing now your materialistic gain so whatever that was blocking your materialistic aspect of yourself and your gains uh, the wheel of fortune is going to bring and bring this in balance the base chakra so this this is going to be good and let's see what we're going to do because sometimes I really also need to do this for my base chakra is the it's not the first chakra the earth chakra is the first chakra okay the base chakra color red so you have the energy vibration you work with the energy vibration of the color red the sound is lum 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 and you have the earth element and it's the glands the and um adrenal glands and then we have i have so never said i hope i have i i wish i have no i have whatever it is that you need i have the money i need to do this i have the positive energy i have the love within me that i need to get over this situation i have the inner strength so it's always i have it's not i hope i have no i have if you're going to put a hope you are breaking your own energy vibration because you're open i have i am going to be a success i'm going to be happy i have been happy i have always been happy so you have to know that whatsoever we how we um how we make a sentence that is what you're attracting to yourself how you make a sentence that is what you're attracting to yourself so you need to understand these things okay as we go forward let's look and see what the energy of the e oracle have for you guys let's see what it's gonna come out gut and oh yeah gut and oh yeah okay number 29 Got and oh yeah, okay. Let's see what is happening. Got and oh yeah, got and oh yeah, okay. Hope you can hear Bob Marley. <laughs> okay, okay, I guess it's funny. Hope you can hear Bob Marley singing in the distance because despite what appears to be physically um, blips right now, everything everything is gonna be all right uh, this is a time of sweet sweet healing a time of renewal take a step back put your feet up and suck up the reservation of power of the universe so this is good so it's as if um because the song from Bob Marley which is one of my favorite favorite artists um I guess you know when you think of Bob Marley and music I think Jamaica has brought out one of the best ever music um, association because Jamaicans are the one who uh, and Bob Marley was the one who bring reggae to the international chart and you know Bob Marley is one of those um, legend who you should never forget because in all his music um, I think the world start to communicate via music and with all his music whenever he sings you know everything is gonna be alright everything is gonna be alright now everything's gonna be alright no woman no cry so you know this is so so good so God on it holy is just gonna be good because his song and he's a legendary and I can tell you I have like all his CDs all his records that he has ever brought out because um, I find that reggae music really heals you and and, and I think people have um, the um, and I should do a video over this because you know it's it's, it's it's wonderful this is an artist that has made and has changed the lives of millions of people and as you can always see the good artists always die young so you know if you really want to know if someone was good and, and truly in spirit they always die long young so here's this is what despite it says Hope you can hear Bob Marley sing in the distance because despite what appears to be a physical blip right now, 
every little things is gonna be all right and this is wonderful um, and I think each and every person should have this song in your car and I'm sure if, if, if there is a bad day and you, you know the song comes on on the radio everything is gonna be all right everything's gonna be all right now everything's gonna be all right no woman no cry remember this people and um, and um, you know whatever blips whatever is happening it's gonna be okay all right can't sing but I always sing in, in my car with my music so um, there we are everything is gonna be all right and you women no matter what you're going through trust me survival is the key no listen to this song because um, you know um, a lot of people always say um, if you have been born in a in a, in a country as the, as Jamaican then you um, can uh, survive anything in the world so women out there who are going to certain situation in your life it's gonna be all right okay and your message is ask for help from others ask for help from others so if you're having situation which you're looking a job you're trying to um, connect with this you're trying to connect with that and that sort of a thing ask for help from others and you will receive that help okay so whatever situation is happening ask for help from others and you will receive that help okay so it's gonna be a um, a wonderful um, positive energies that is coming through in this week um, whatever the situation is it's all about your financial situation and um, this week is going to the, the, the energy of the Sun and whatever your financial disability was or disposability was it's going to be positive and it's going to come in a positive way and I want to say to you remember to listen to your Sun moon and rising sign remember also to um, remember also to bring up and listen the monthly reading again because we have five weeks in this month this is the third week of this month so listen the reading for the next two weeks of the month so you don't have to listen to the old video but go from the third week and listen to the reading after the third week okay so it's gonna be wonderful for you guys whatever is happening be positive um, love is going to be positive in this week whatever is going on for you guys it's going to be whatever conflicts that you have is a little friendly conflicts okay it's a, it's a little friendly competition so um, I want to say namaste until next week